You trying to do the beat with your mouth? Yeah, man. The intro. The okay. intro is too nice. Mm -hmm. The other day, my friend was saying, "Why, why are fat people the best beatboxers?" <laughs> Damn, it's kind of well. I notice a lot of. But uh, that's what I notice. Uh, they have yeah. uh, a lot of lung, <laughs> lung capacity. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Damn, yeah. No, but it, it is true though. Is it? No, but like what is it? I mean, I, I say back in the day, like it was mostly fat people. Now it's like mostly Asians. Like oh, the, okay, those, yeah, yeah. Like, insane like beatboxers Beatbox, yeah korean effects i used to love beatbox like watching those yeah, things, yeah, like. yeah 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 i wish i could beatbox though honestly i used to you do can, it yeah, yo bro do, remember when we were can, like back bro. in high school yeah yeah yeah. i can't bro <laughs> no, it's trash <laughs> but yeah i remember like, back so in high amateur. school you used to do that uh what's that uh <laughs> <laughs> there was a there was a viral video of like uh like talent like there was a fat guy beatboxing he, he did songs <laughs> yeah. i think you were recreating some i don't know what you were mm. recreating but i think i, I tried doing I, it I, like you did you tried so much one stuff. song that you did it was um it was a timbaland yeah, is it? yeah yeah like, timbaland yeah uh, i forgot the name called? dude the sample <laughs> for <laughs> doing, <he's> doing, he's <laughs> doing. <laughs> Trash. I, know, I know you were like, the, like you were doing the. I got no money. Yeah, 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 that that one. One. Anyways, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, welcome back to the hype convo. It's your boy Taj. It's your boy Howie. It's your boy CJ. We here with another topic today. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm got a quick question for y'all. How many X's is too many X's? Mm. Oh, like dating. Yeah, dating, dating wise. Oh. <sighs> Let's say you meet a girl mm -hmm. for the first time, going on a date, mm -hmm. you you like her, and she tells you a number of how many exes she had. Because you asked her, like, oh, yeah, how many yeah. exes you had in the past? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. I, I think that's something guys ask, no? Yeah. I, I mean, yeah. like, it's something you want to find out, like, yeah. her past, like, uh, yeah. Exactly. If you're going to try to build a future, yeah. if you're serious with that girl, then yeah, yeah, I think yeah, you yeah. want to know a little bit about her past. Yeah, 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 exactly. I mean, for sure, too too many exes, like too many re relationships, is gonna is a bad sign for me. Yeah, because you I know, can see that. Mm -hmm. if you have too many relationships back then, and it never worked out, like the problem could be her, her. The, yeah, true. Yeah. the common denominator, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So, and depending also how long those relationships were. Yeah, yeah. Because some people like go through like relationships real quick like yeah one month all right next one month yeah. like. so like in our age like middle mid 20s i'd say for me it's like if it's too uh, too uh, many like uh, uh i say like 10 is a, a yeah like two, what's too many yeah. x's for you okay for me like okay you have like, answer? i don't know like 10 is a lot though yeah so for me like, 10 is a lot that is a lot yeah for me too i would say 10 is a lot um, but nine is when you think about it nine is also a lot <laughs> <laughs> eight is a lot, is a lot. But I like, mean, about like going okay like what would you think when it starts going a lot not saying that okay you might not go with a girl like that well, but let's say how many X's is a bit too much for you double digits double digits no for me that's yeah for me that's I think too much for me at least I mean like let's say in like in person like most of the people you know how many exes they like what's the average I mean there's the also average. people that count like uh, like elementary like uh, relationships and like high school mm -hmm. it's not really uh, serious but yeah, it's still yeah. a relationship you know so like I mean, it didn't have to be serious, I, yeah. but it's still a relationship that they count like, I don't does count that count or not because I, 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 like I person, yeah I personally like I don't count that mm -hmm. high school I'm mean, Element like elementary oh, because okay. that's some kids, kids stuff. Yeah. But it's still an unless, X. But when you still talk about that person, like it's, it's, still a, a, it's still an X, right? Because like, like, I, cause I, I had one, but it was two months. It was like so. Yeah. Like I don't know if I do. I don't really consider. It was that just like, way. you know, like oh, you like her, you it, like her back. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It yeah, didn't so. count because okay. now the Let, when you grow older, yeah, that's like when you're older. Okay, at, yeah. at least high school, I'd say. At least high school. At least after high school, then I would say if you go, for me, I think even like going above five, it gets yeah, yeah. it gets a lot. It's you know? a lot, mm -hmm. but the, for me, it depends on how long those relationships yeah. were. Because mm -hmm. if they're all like short, like a mo less than uh, less than six months, let's say it's like, what's not working? You know, like how is it not lasting mm -hmm. that long? Like, and you're gonna be like, oh damn, that means like 
this is not gonna work out too like that long you know it's like you're yeah. wasting your time with them you know yeah yeah, yeah. unless like i don't know she changed somehow but i don't yeah. know or what if the girl didn't actually find the one you know like yeah, she's, yeah. Oh, true, she's yeah. going through yeah, people yeah. right like then, it's like okay he, she found something that she didn't like so that's why she broke it off or yeah. something right like yeah uh-huh because like i think like i know some people who've been to like four or five i mean they're like they're not bad like it's just that they probably didn't find mm-hmm. like something was not working out because it's still a two-way street you know it's not like for sure like most of the time it's a two-way yeah. street right? yeah so it's like but also like d- dating wise like relationship right like because mm-hmm. like going on tinder dates is like it doesn't count right like People, a lot of people go like every yeah, yeah. often. It's, like, it doesn't become your yeah, ex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Not that's not that's talking one as ex. Yeah, so like, yeah, yeah. That's like a different, that's like okay. body count, I guess. Or oh, yeah, that's a different or topic. Or just like yeah. a quick date for me, that's not a relationship, okay, okay. you know, so. But yeah. I mean, it doesn't have to become a body count <laughs> <laughs> on the first date. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> how are you thinking for, man? No, I mean, well, like, yeah, like, a lot of people. How we got some experience, man? chill. <laughs> but like Tinder, like a lot of people are there do to, that. Like yeah. they are are in Tinder to do that. Yeah, yeah. So. exactly. But, but not not everyone, obviously. Oh, no, for sure. But if we say it like this, where for you, how many exes you have to go through in order to find the one? Is there like a number? For me, there's no number because like yeah. finding the one is, I like. You could, it could be the first one, you know, like, like if everything clicks yeah. right away, it could be the first one. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, like going with the definition of dating, like you're dating just so you can marry that person, right? Mm-hmm. For you, exactly, to yeah. find the one, yeah, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, exactly, yeah. But like, uh, let's say, okay, let's say you think you found the one mm-hmm. after, Ex- yeah, one, your first mm-hmm. relationship. You say like, are you gonna be like pulling the trigger because that's your first one, or you're not gonna pull the trigger? Because that it's is your first, first one. one. You're like, no, maybe there's you know, like okay. better out there. There's a better out there, or it's just like I haven't I, tried I, everything. You know, I'm scared of uh-huh. you know making a move because I haven't yeah. gone through other relationships. Okay, mm. but uh, for rare occurrences, like it could happen where it's like your first one and your last one, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. like that's it could happen where it's, mm-hmm. you're gonna end up marrying that person and it's like you've been dating for a while, the f- same person. Yeah, some people that work, but. Them, yeah. Like what I like, what I would recommend is like get experience first. You know, like yeah, yeah. Like uh, yeah. just explore. To yeah, go I on think, dates, yeah, but go, not go on an actual relationship. You could you could go on relationships, but like if, I'd say like don't force it to be your last one, right? Yeah. If yeah. you don't feel like it's gonna, it's good. Like you, I think some people they go through relationships to like because they learn what about, they like and what yeah. they don't like. Yeah, they they, they learn about themselves too. Right. You know? Yeah. So, yeah. 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 Like oh, I actually don't like this type, so I'm gonna avoid that. Or like exactly, not, yeah. go for another type, mm-hmm. you know. So, and then they end up finding the one because of all the mm-hmm. experience they have, right? You know. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, I see. But you know, now going to the other side where Howie was talking about, like, you know, you go through so many. Uh-huh. <laughs> isn't like your your body count increasing? <laughs> 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 now, let's but, say you, you meet this girl, right, and. You you start liking her, you're d- dating her, and you learn from a mutual friend that yo know, this girl in high school was wild. Dang. You know, like <laughs> she gone through the whole basketball team or something. You know? She was passed around. Like, what's your reaction? Shit. What's your reaction? Mm. Uh, you're sitting on a table and you're like thinking through that comment you just heard yesterday. Because there's yeah. there there are those people where it's like everyone knows them for being like that girl, yeah. like that girl, right? For being like yeah, yeah. I mean, if like me personally, I think that's a turn off. It's like, oh well, like is she okay? I guess there's a difference though. Is is she still like that or like did she change? No, she's changed. She's changed. changed. Let's say she's changed. She's a professional. She has a degree. Yeah, oh. <laughs> she, like know. she's ready for the for the okay. uh, like a real relationship. Yeah. you know, like I don't know. If, and that me, was in the past. For me, it's still hard. Like, cause it, then when people like will also know that 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 her past and. For me, it's just like, dang, I don't, I don't know. For me, it's a turn off. I don't yeah. know why. Okay, because what I think is like, it's still a turn off, but like, I'd rather go with a girl that has, like, uh, let's say ten body count and mm-hmm. ten relationships, right? I'd rather go for the person with ten body count than ten exes because ten body count, they're just there to like have fun and like, they, they it's not nothing serious, right? But mm-hmm. exes is like, 
there's something oh, wrong okay. with it like having 10 exes you know mm, like okay, okay 10 failed relationships right okay okay yeah so yeah and the 10 could be like just 10 like tinder dates you know 10 mm, yeah mm, okay okay it's like yeah it's, i don't know yeah yeah true true if you know I what i mean that. yeah yeah it's i like, see yeah <laughs> that's, so funny, yeah. that's so funny but like they're labeled as something like girls if they go through that in high school let's say like if well, you, yo, yeah exactly it's like if you do it once even yo. once or something you know like and then you end up dating that girl it could and be then, a mistake right yeah and mm. then like people could do mistakes like her nudes are out there in, since high oh, school shit, you know like imagine bad, like, yo. and then the, videos like, yeah and you know for a girl i, I think it's kind of tougher because everybody's gonna call her a, a slut a th- uh, yeah yeah a whore a whole yeah, like, yeah exactly. there, there's so many words you know like yeah people, yeah yeah you know mm-hmm throw around just because mm-hmm. yeah. you know just a mistake that a girl did probably you know like when she was young you know yeah like yeah. she like she's gonna meet like those people like meet someone that ne- like has no no uh, information about wh- or, like what she did since before you know like mm. or mm-hmm. I don't know like someone that doesn't care like <laughs> that he's hurt for how yeah, she yeah, is yeah. now I mean, you know yeah, like, sure. but if a guy does that though you're like yeah or something <laughs> yeah like, yo for real like, like, a double standard, standard. like yo props to you bro yeah, it's you a double like, standard I have like, friends that like they told me that they did like a competition with their friends and they're just like oh I, I smashed this girl and this girl like they're counting and like oh I have more I'm like dang and they're yeah. like they're giving props to each other you know real, like, but if it's a girl like uh, dang you thought you were sluts like there's a double standard for sure bro. for real like in society like guy with multiple body count is like Oh, oh shit, shit impressive is... yeah. when a girl gets a high body count it's like, like damn man, what a what a sludge yeah, what a man, man. pussy loose yeah. Yeah. pussy loose <laughs> What I think about ge- gender neutral yeah, is like STDs, up. yo. <laughs> yeah. They're full of STDs, you know. I think like, yeah, either mm-hmm. case like yeah. for me it's just like yo you guys are like full of STDs. That's yeah. what I think like <laughs> That's I think what you, I think, man. The question is like just like ask ask around like did she use a condom with you? Did she use a condom with you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's crazy generation though like yeah, yeah. people could get along with another person so easily now through like just online to just like yeah bro yeah that's that's an interesting thing be, be with that double standard yeah yeah no for, for sure. sure everything is like there's a lot of double standards yeah. in the like in the world yeah. right now anyways let us know what you think about these double standards in the comment section below yeah. uh make sure to like this video Follow us on TikTok TikTok. and subscribe to our channel. I'll see you guys on the next episode. It's your boy Taj. It's your boy Howie. It's your boy CJ. And we the Hype Convo. Peace. Peace. Peace.